except curiously enough the two places that I would probably expand um, I might go for the high yield but I think that spots really risky so I would probably go here just put my army up here uh, it's a large choke point but it's not nearly the size of this one especially with that watchtower there and here of course would be great all I would need was be a couple uh, missile turrets along the border and this one would be uh, secure so I uh, just uh, building up my army again and what's the production nobody's producing anything so I did stop it looks like I'm supply locked um, because he did kill that SCV that was constantly building supply depots and I never quite get back on the gas at my main um, he is still completely uh, destroying me in terms of harvester count. Right now, the only difference seems to be uh, the, the gas, as the minerals are pretty close. A uh, little differential here and there. Um, but as you can see up here, 4,500 uh, minerals, 1,700 gas, just so many unspent minerals. Uh, needs a, another expansion, uh, maybe just a, a hatchery, but... No, he's just not using the larva. And here comes the first engagement. Uh, the Zerglings really stand no chance. They can't get a good surround. Uh, these four roaches will go down pretty easy. Oh, so there was a fifth coming in. They do burrow. Um, do I set a new rally point? Um, well, I do keep some of uh, my army here. Oh, I do take... Oh no, he did get Burrow back before I could destroy him. So then I come over here, take out his expansion. Uh, really no chance for him at anymore. That queen goes down very easy. And trying to take out those lava, but no, they do start morphing in into Zerglings. Really sh I would prefer if he went for Roaches. He is getting Roaches as well. Uh, maybe mutas, because then uh, the marauders would not hit any of the mutas. It would just be the marines. And then he could try to focus down the medevacs and then take out the marines. And then he would just be left with marauders that can attack the mutas. The expansion goes down. He's transferred back to his main base, which is almost mined out. He's got 24 uh, drones on just three patches left. Zerglings come up, they are get, able to get a group surrounded on a couple of marines, but the army is just too large at this point. And yes, fully, uh, fully healed again. Except for the medevacs, which of course uh, <laughs> don't really need uh, to be healed, they take a lot of damage. I don't even bother upgrading them most times unless the game goes really long. Um, but uh, oh, no, he sends in the mutas again um, as kind of a counterattack. And I'm kind of left with what I had in the base, but um, I, I do some quick math. And I figure that um, the my army can uh, wipe out his, um, his base long before these mutas can even hope to take out mine. But I am supply locked, so I can't produce many more um, marines to try to take out mutas, uh, but really no chance at this point. Uh, he's only got a few buildings left. I was scared of an expansion, but then uh, when I see these drones just hanging out, I know that the game is won. So uh, once that spawning pool, those two extractors, and that hatchery goes down, it will be game over. And these mutas, I mean, for, what is that, six units, seven units? Look how slow that barracks is going down. Mutas are not good against the buildings. Bottom line, not as good as marauders, which are um, what is usually left when I send in my um, marine uh, marauder ball. I usually end up with a lot more uh, marauders than I do marines. This one seems surprisingly marine heavy. Even though, did I, did I ever get, no, I never got the combat shield. So I'm not sure why uh, it seemed pretty even. Oh, so he does have a building. There he goes. He does leave the game. 
So, uh, just a relatively quick game. I was able to counter the Urgly Zer Zergling Rush with some SCVs. Um, I, I was unprepared for the Muta Harass, and as you can see, I'm still unprepared for it. If they went over here, I, I should have built Missile Turrets right here, 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 and here, uh, just to guard um, that Orbital Command. But meters are just so slow against buildings, uh, not nearly as fast as uh, an infantry ball from uh, the Terran army. Um, he never brought those roaches back up, um, never really went uh, for army after that initial zergling rush, and that really cost him the game. So many unspent minerals, uh, still 4,000, 2,000, even when he was being destroyed, uh, he would not, uh, he could not catch up uh, with production in terms of uh, what I had going for me, even with that, the, the mutas stopping my supply uh, or late into the game. So um, there we go, another uh, game on Desert Oasis. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope to see you next time. Bye.